Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to import a PDF file into AutoCAD. This is a quite recent tool and it can be very useful for some cases. Let's see. We are going to the main ribbon, clicking insert here and then you can see this icon that says PDF import. We will click here and I'm going to choose a PDF file, for example this one. I click in open and you can see this window here with few options to set up. At this moment I'm going to import all the vector geometry of the PDF which we can select here and we will also use the PDF layers by checking here and this will keep the original layers if this drawing is created with a recent version of AutoCAD now I specify the insertion point and here you have my PDF if I go left with a pointer to the layer properties manager I can see all the layers that were created in the original AutoCAD file. Now let's see what happened with the dimension lines. As you can notice, they are no longer considered dimension lines and they were split in lines and in text, which is actually very good. So I can double click in the text and modify it. But of course, we can only do this with true type text, otherwise it will be split in very small curves, lines and hatches. Ok, on the next part I'm going to show you another example. This time I will choose the site plan which has a raster image here. And you will see what happened if I click in OK now. I will click to specify the base point and as you see I cannot see the image here. So if I want to insert a file with an image inside I should check this box that says raster image. I click in OK and this time when I click to insert the PDF it will appear here, as you see. There are also some changes that we can do to raster images. If I select the image, it opens this new toolbar. Here I can do some changes, like change the brightness, contrast and fade. I'm going to click in this bar, hold it and drag it. And you can see that with this, I can for example draw anything and it will be very easy to see. So this was everything in this tutorial, thank you very much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to Cut in Black to watch all the content in AutoCAD. If you still have some issues, I can provide to you online private lessons for beginners. Just send me an email or have a look in my channel page to check out any details. Thank you and see you next time!